Hi there. So uh, it's uh, what day is it? Wednesday. Um, it's uh, a bit greyer today and no sign of any sun. So I'm having a more restful day back at Sheldon. Uh, I've just been reflecting a little bit this morning and uh, on just the last few years. And uh, I've just come out to, um, you can see behind me is the labyrinth. Uh, and I'll show you that a bit more in a moment. So uh, the labyrinth is uh, a special place which you go and pray. And the idea is that you uh, just go in and as you walk around to the center, you pray and leave stuff with God. And then you get to the center and then you walk all the way back. And I've never really done labyrinths properly before, never really got it, but I've just done it and found it really helpful and found it really profound. Um, and uh, as we've been doing this, I've just been following some guidelines, which has been uh, reading, reflecting on Psalm 23. So, um, Dad, if you're watching, I wonder if you remember Psalm 23. Let me just read it to you and you might well remember this. Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord my whole life long. So I've been reflecting on that as uh, I've gone around the labyrinth. And uh, I think the thing that particularly struck me was that um, it says on these instructions that the labyrinth that has, uh, has no dead ends and all the paths um, lead. Let me just read it out to you. It says, um, I can't find it now. It says it has no, no dead ends and all the paths um, just eventually lead to the centre. And I, my profound thought for today is that actually, as you'll see, because I'm going to take you around it in a minute, um, you start off going quite close to the centre and you really think that actually you're nearly really at the centre right at the start. But actually it takes you on a really wiggly journey that you've no idea where you're going, you've no idea where you get to, um, you've no idea the route you're taking, but eventually it does get to the center and I've been reflecting on that and thinking that's quite profound. So I'm gonna take you on a speedy tour of the labyrinth. So here we are at the start and here we go. You see here, we think we're nearly at the center, but actually we're only just started. And that is the labyrinth. I just had some very strange stares from people who saw me walking around it with a video very fast. And uh, I think they're thinking I'm not doing it properly, but um, I don't know they realize I'd done it properly beforehand. But anyway, uh, so that's the labyrinth and that's been my morning. I'm not quite sure what this afternoon holds, but we'll see later. Okay, bye.